Northern Thailand's fertile mountains and verdant valleys are home to a diverse array of cultures and traditions. This is a land of sacred places and ancient customs. Of the deeply spiritual and truly exotic. Here, elephants and humans have formed deep relationships. And skilled artisans create an ever-evolving kaleidoscope of color and form. This mountainous land, known as the Golden Triangle, was once the opium-producing capital of Asia. Today, it's virtually poppy-free and tourist-friendly. The Golden Triangle covers more than 200 square miles, encompassing the mountainous region of Burma, Laos, Vietnam, and Thailand. The border region of northern Thailand is home to about 20 different ethnic groups, or hill tribes. Each hill tribe has its own language and unique traditions. Just getting to the tribes is an adventure, a magical journey on elephant and bamboo raft into the heart of the Golden Triangle. The forest is primeval, as if ripped from the pages of Kipling's Jungle Book. There are very few places like this left in the world, and those that do remain are rapidly disappearing. In northern Thailand, you can still find lush forests and authentic hill tribe cultures. Elephants have been part of Thai life and culture for thousands of years. Mahuts, the drivers and caretakers of elephants, will often spend more time with their elephants than with their own families. It's a bond unlike any other in the animal kingdom. My journey to a nearby Lisu village begins at the Mei Taman elephant camp. There's no experience quite like riding an elephant. Now the rustle of the tall grass, the music of the fast flowing creek. This is the way to see the countryside in the jungle aboard the ultimate all-terrain vehicle. <laughs> 